for the next five minutes, I want your full attention. But I want you to respect something here. I want you to respect Jesus. The past week has been so, so loud that at the end we can forget the essence of all these things. It's been so loud that most of us have don't even understand what's going on. So you're just commenting and just commenting, just talking. And it's so complex that you, you are in the spin of it, but you don't know. And I'll explain. There are things that are paramount in life, but I think the most paramount thing is Jesus. Because, because he is not about, about name tags and truck tags. He's not about religion or not religion. No, 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 no. He's about, he's about God and eternity. And, 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 and that's the essence of, of, this, of, of, of all of this. So, so for the next five minutes, just repent. Repent. Repent if you've made this this six past six months about anything else. And and be humble about it. And it's all said and done. Oh glory is to it. Oh glory is to it. When it's all said and done. Oh glory is to it. Oh glory to I am a set and so when it's all said as a body we repent as a body we repent as a body we stand and repent when it's all said and done oh glory to the Say hi to somebody, say hi to somebody, greet somebody, say hi. 
How are you doing? Say hi. My guys from, from um, Global, hi, how are you doing? Amen. Now please, I would love your attention as I speak. And I would love you to open your mind to things that might challenge what you think and how you think. Um, this is for 40 minutes, but I'm going to 30 so we can, we can have conversations after church, after the, the conversation. I want to start by addressing um, the trending issue, but giving you a different context completely. I spoke to my father, so there are people that I respect, and I respect them because they have, they have context, they have character. So this is how I respect you, if you have character, and if you have clarity, I respect you. So I have a few fathers that I speak to, and I spoke to about two, three fathers. Um, my own father said about this issue, I will not condemn, criticize, or condemn, criticize, or complain. I will pray for the body of Christ. Yes. That was his own context, going to my priest. And I asked that why, and he said that this is deeper than, deeper than everything. It's very, so that was one context. Then the second context was my father, um, one of my father, Pity, but he said, there are battles that you fight, but in this generation, pick your battles and fight it. Learn to pick battles and fight. That was his second comment. But the third one is the one I want to share. And this should make you a bit more serious with the work of God. On Friday or Thursday, that news broke. And there's a guy called Olamide. You know Olamide? Badosne. The same day, he released a song. Not, not him. His good friend called Naira Mali released a song called Sopi. Now, please, I'm going somewhere. And, and Sopi, please follow me clearly. Now, now I, I, I asked for your introduction, so follow me. And Sopi means masturbation. There's a dance to it. And the context was if you don't rape, master, beat. Now, please follow me clearly, because, because most people think that they know. And I'm in a generation who just think they know. It's, it's deeper than you think. And if you, if you, because I work in the media space, I, I actually do branding for secular brands. On Instagram or Twitter, it's catching fire. Now, my point is, I'm going somewhere. Something happens here, and the devil can also prefer a solution to that looks less than the issue, but would take a generation through an identity journey. When you stand as a Christian, you must stand in, in humility because you don't know all the context. Of a particular issue. You don't know all the context of a particular issue. My aunties are angry because some of them have been molested. molested. So their context is fat. Men are afraid. Most men here that I know are saying, Lord, give me character. That's the that angle. Social media is talking about Sopi. That's the angle. Churches are afraid because it's still the body of Christ. There's still one body. Christ is not going to come and take one. He's taking all. That's the angle. So, my question for you is, how do you fight all these angles? So, how do you fight all the angles? Because logically, as a man of character, logically, if you, want to, if you're, if you can't hold yourself, masturbate. Yeah, yes, no. If you can't hold yourself, masturbate. So Christians, when, I was, when my, my junior brother was in university, he was in year two, and my dad, my dad, he was made a pastor in Ife. In Ife. 
that's um, law school, and the, he was in law. My dad drove to a fair. He was made a pastor on Monday, so he was not telling us I'm a pastor. On Sunday, my brother drove to school in church and said that if he catches this, his son holding a mic, he will beat his son. <laughs> it was the most embarrassing thing that my brother had gone to his life. Because I, I went to university church. I was in CFI. I know how, I know how powerful to, in that university you become like a church leader. It was in year two. My brother can speak well. My brother drove to an affair. That was one of the worst things that has happened to that happened to that boy. She was a hit and that was like first of all, my father said he was he, 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 he got distinction in diploma in Unilag and in affair. My father said he's going to be fair. All the Lagos, I, I school in King's College, we all school in KC. All his Lagos friends were lag. So his swag had very jobs. His swag had had you know what I mean now? His swag had dropped a bit. Now in fair. To find some community, he became a church leader. My father said, never. It was last year my father now explained to us why he did that. And I want to take you back to the story of Moses. Let's go, to, let's go. Do we want to, you know, let's share, the, let's share the story of Moses. And Moses was who? Who was Moses? Let's start, who was Moses? He was what? He was an Israelite. But then what happened? He was trained where? In Egypt. In the house of what? Pharaoh. Pharaoh. Fantastic house. And then what happened? One day he saw an Israelite being what? Beaten by who? By Egyptian. And then he started realizing he was not what? From Egypt. He was an Israelite. And he went to what? Attack. And then what happened? He killed the Egyptian and he ran away. It was a murderer, as it was a pretend of saint. And what happened? For 40 years, he was in the wilderness. And a confident man, 40 years later, started stammering. Because in 40 years, God purged him of self dependence. My point is we're in a generation where everybody thinks they can be Moses without capacity. You think you can be Moses without what? Capacity. When I came here this morning, do you know what I was thinking about? Uh, you know what? I wish in 10 years time, I come, I come here, I just tell Koli, Koli, I need one, one million shirts from China, one million shirts that says, so please not the way, something like that. One million shirts, give it for free. Sawana, I need like, I need to give 10 million dollars. Let's do, let's buy, um, at boards around Nigeria. Xavier, please, in, in, Xavier, please, I need you to work on a script and fund it. Fund me. You use your, your money, half a million dollars, and fight this campaign. My point is that's where we should go into. We should be, we should be Moses with capacity. So, so today's, today's Sunday service is about capacity. But the first thing I want to first put on, on the ground is humility. Do you agree you don't know? Can, can, can you put your hands up? Yes. Yes. We have to learn, we have to be humble. Let's, let's open Daniel first, Daniel chapter 2. So, so in this season, there might be a different tone, and it's fine. It is love, because we must make strong men. Do you agree? Yes, yeah. yeah, strong men. So Daniel 2. Strong people, not, not flaky. I am producing a football show right now for Super Sports. And I was speaking to a coach. No, yesterday I played, I played a match. We played with one oil and gas company. And the, the oil and gas company had a football coach with them. I learned something yesterday. The, the defender stayed back. The midfielder did not attack. Us. <laughs> <laughs> the keeper was calm. I watched it, I saw discipline. It's not everything you comment, it's not everything you go for. Yes. It's not everything you attack. Mm -hmm. It's not every battle you fight now. Yes. Yes. No, I'm not talking about even just this context in life. Yes. It's not every, every idea you, you, you start shooting the video now. You calm yourself down. You count the cost. 
It's not every business plan that's for today. It's not every course you should read now. I had a friend who said that he had to wait for five years in marriage till his wife had kids and this before he went to the exam PA. You count the cost. You count the cost. So, so my first, my first imprint is humility. Guys, Daniel 2. Because let me like this period and they ask me questions. My God. And I honestly speaking, I don't have answers. I have all the answers. If anyone was like, let's do a campaign. One of the um, one of the guys in music is a top guy. Let's do a campaign against this will be. Yeah, I said, brother, you, you, you don't have the capacity. Like you, you can't scratch the capacity. You don't have the, the financial capacity. Like you can't scratch the capacity. The charisma, the quality of video, you don't have it. You don't have it. Don't even go there. So my point is, we're a young church. Can we, can we use that, you know that 40 year thing that happened to Moses? Can we build capacity for 25 years? You, do you want to attack, do you want to fight on a million on Instagram? You, don't, you, you have nothing. Do you, you have the capacity, do you have, the, do you have the, the links on all the big blogs? Can you call to the Edmonds and say, Edmonds, I'm giving you two million right now. Post my, post my capacity influence. So let's, let's, first, let's first arrange ourselves and calm down. That staying, coming here on a Sunday morning, lock this door, is not what the Bible says, that the, the endless what, expectations of the world's creations. It's not, it's not it all. It's not this just locking your door here quietly. It's not that. Let's first put this in our minds. It's more than that. It's me calling Chikubi, Chikubi, I need an animation that will fight this thing. Chikubi will say how much. Chikubi will yeah, work for two years. Is, is capacity strength? Honestly, let me also say this here. A side comment. I saw a young pastor, a very young pastor on Instagram, and he was he was commenting on how a pastor was honoring him, hmm? and my mind cringed. And I'll tell you why. The body of Christ sometimes causes its own wahala by putting madness on people on your own you would carry what is for god and put on a man and a man that cops sneezes that man becomes what he's not meant to be so sometimes also i'm bringing i'm trying to say that see guys i'm for it i i am ezekiel i don't know it i don't know it i'm allowed to not know it and this this is the posture for the body of christ this is the posture. You don't come, you come and men put wahala on a man. Like the man is on his own. No. Take it. Take it now on his own. Then he rises because men put it on him. So in the tribe, that's a, a clear no man shall put pressure on, on what? Are we, are, we on, are, we, are we good? Yes. Clap for yourselves. Let's do this. Verse 2. Verse 2. So what does so what does he say? He say what? He summoned ma magicians, enchanters. Verse three. He says what? I've had a dream that what? And I mean to know. Verse four. Oh king, tell your servants the dream and we will interpret it. The king said, No way. Problem. In this in this episode of. Nigerian drama, super story. The king said, no way. Tell me my dream. Well, you must tell me my words, my dream. I'm going somewhere, please. You must what? Tell me my, my dream. Next verse. But if you don't what? Tell me your dream and what? You will receive gifts and rewards. Next verse. One, one, one more. Next verse, next verse, please. And what? <laughs> they are trying to what? Because you realize that this is what I have finally. Family. Next verse. And this, this is what he said. What do you say? Please get together. One, two, three, go. 
was the king is a very bad guy. Just one. <laughs> Do you know if he, if he has told Shegon, my Shegon, there is just one penalty. So the check might say, I'm gonna get fired. Like like, oh okay, maybe you will give me my full fee, but you give me my consulting fee. Like yeah, you are winning the just one. Continue please. Pause. Now Shekou will be shaking. From just one, I know you have conspired. Huh? <laughs> we are playing before now. Baba. Baba, next one. Hoping the what? So then, tell me the dream, and I will know that you can't. Next verse. Pause. My posture this season is that verse. There is no Christian on earth who can do what the world, who can solve this world problem. There's no Christian. There is no secular scientist on earth who can solve what the world's problem. There's none. There is no politician who can solve Nigeria's problem. That's the first context. In your family, trust me, you might not have the capacity to solve what your family's problem. Let's 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 step back. Let's calm down. Next verse. What the king asks is what? No one can reveal it to the king except the gods. And they do not leave clarity. But we're going to tell them that we are gods that live above. But we're somewhere. Next verse. This made the king and furious that he ordered. My point is, do you know that when things happen in the world, it affects the church? Um, I carry a burden for the next generation. There's something in, in uh, there's something in brand so I, I work as a brand strategist. There's something in branding called barrier to entry. Do you know what it means? So let, let me explain. It means that, okay, so Budweiser is a brand that I, I work on for the football show. Budweiser does something called, in, in other countries, they do tattoos. So they have some, something called tattoo bottles in other brands, in other, in, in other markets. In Nigeria, they cleared them. They told them that in Nigeria, men that drink beer are religious. So yes, that some men drink beer on Saturday nights and on Sunday morning go to church. That there's a barrier to entry of trying to do tattoo. That, that this men that drink beer hates tattoo. <laughs> do you get the point? Do you get the point? That it is not a, they might like your beer, but hate the tattoo. So you are, you are bringing a barrier to entry. Do you get the point? Are we together? Are we together? We're together. That let's you know what? Give an example. So that, give, give an example so we can understand that concept of barrier to entry. Give me an example. Okay, an example. Pepe. Some tribes don't eat pepe. An auntie, <laughs> an auntie's cooking food. Amazing food. I go see everything. But she, she just, she just see her hair Slow motion. <laughs> Pepe. That's a barrier to what? Entry. Entry. Yes, you get the point? Yeah. Who hates fish? Who hates fish? Good. Now, you are cooking stew. The stew is looking nice. And you just saw it. Come. Boop. Barrier to what? Entry. Are we together? Is the, is the idea known now? Now, do you think that there's a generation that all this crazy gist on lesbianism, presentantity, quantitantity, <laughs> is creating a barrier to entry for Christ? Yes. Yes. Of who? Of Jesus. Jesus. Am I correct? Yes. In, the, in the tribe is to know him and to make him no. That is the basic of. So, are we together? Yes. Are we together? Next verse. So, next verse. No, so go back. At this point, please listen. At this point, Xavier, such a great man, walking somewhere 
in a jar. Did not know what was going on somewhere at Lagos State Government. But they're about to kill everybody, including him. Do you get the point? Are we together? Oh, don't think that your daughter, somewhere in somebody's body, because you're not married, or don't think that your son, somewhere, will not be affected by what? By the king's order. Don't get, don't, don't get it twisted. Don't think that someday something in policy, in the government, will not affect you. Don't think. Don't think so. Don't think so. Don't think so. Don't think that, tell me, someday something will not affect you. It was when my and my cousin's best friend, my cousin, if my cousin, her best friend's daughter is in the UK, and she came home one day and she, that she's now, she's totally like a lesbian, and she is bold about it. That's when my auntie started praying for her children. <laughs> because it, it, it became closer to home. Yes. It is when your junior brother at 2 a.m. you're seeing smoking something, taking cocaine, like, then it gets closer to home. Then you begin to. Next verse, please. So the decree was what? To put the wise men to death. And men were sent to look for who? Are you seeing that? When it was time. To go and interpret, to collect the money. Did he call him? Did he call him? We were time to die. My guy was dying. But, but you know, that's the way of the world. We, we don't chop together, but we go down together. That's the way of the world now. Next verse. So, now this is where I want to begin this, this service. The first thing he did was what? Daniel spoke. So when Ariok, the commander of the king's guard, had gone to put the debt, to put the, the wise men of what? They had packed them all. Hope you, let me paint the story. They already packed everybody. Black Maria. Black Maria. SAS. They've arranged everybody. So it was not to pick Daniel and his guys. What happened? Daniel spoke to him with what? And tapped. Guys. In this generation, do you think we carry wisdom or what? Intact? I don't think so. Should I very sincere with you? Most of us at this point would have been died, would have been killed. At this point. Yes. Most of us at this point would have died. Do you agree? Yes. At this point would have died. Because someone will say, Am I involved? Oof. That's the first death. Someone will say, please don't. Poof. How can you comment? Poof. Would you know who I am? That's, that's the gas room. Do you know who I am? Shut <laughs> Let's go and protest. Shoko. Before even Daniel got the solution, he had been killed. Yes. Most of us have been killed. Going somewhere. The first rule is what? Wisdom and talent. Let me give an example. So you've learned today about barrier to what? Let me see the thing of branding. The second thing is being a master of exclusion. I'll go somewhere. I must teach this. So, so Shago can sing, play, play the guitar, animate. You know he animates very well. It's clap for him. He's, he, does, he does scripting very well. He's a script writer. He has fine hair. Some people's natural hair is not like, oh, is it natural hair now? Is that Jericho? Is that Pam? Is that attachment? So he has a lot of things. But then he now goes for a meeting with, a, with the head of Sony Animations. And they ask him, 
Shegon, what do you do? I play guitar. Okay. So Shegon, what do you really do? <laughs> My guy, I can play on all chords. <laughs> <laughs> Shegon, for the last time. Oh yeah, what do you do? I wrote ah, uh, oh, 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 I wrote that song. My point is, at that point, he must be a master words exclusion. He must just speak about animation. what he does. Animation. Are we together? So two things. One is barrier to entry. Two is master's words of exclusion. All things are expedient. No, all things are what? Lawful, but not what? In, at that point, what is expedient is what? Animation. animation. At this point, I tell you, Daniel could have said many things. Many things, Daniel, many things. Like me, I'll first give you, but just at that point, he spoke with what? Wisdom and tact. My dear friends, in this season, because you are custodians of Jesus, you must learn to speak with what? Wisdom and tact. It is tough. It is very. Do you know how many people this weekend just we put my leg? Because if I say one thing, that, like I know how it is now. You know how Messi. Do you know Messi? The footballer. You know Messi. He is the man of. He will. He will trap you as you put your leg. As you put you. And people. People and people do that. Yeah. They'll be pulling you. You too. Ogufe. <laughs> <laughs> catch you, eat you. Next, next slide. But please, sorry, I hope you're writing these things down. I'll go again. First is humility. That's what, that what? We don't know anything. You yeah, agree? Yeah. Second is what? Barriers to entry. That the more these things happen, there's a generation that, that will what? Pull back from God. Third is what? No matter of what? Exclusion. In this season, as you said, in this season, what is God saying? Listen, God says a lot of things. Do you know that? God is so, or you think God is one? God is robust. But in this season, what is the one thing he's saying? In this, what is the one thing he's saying to the body, the local assembly, to you? What's that one thing? Because if you want to, the Bible the Bible without knowledge and tact and wisdom can be self, can be contradictory. Wait, 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 am, I, am I wrong? But what is the one thing he's saying this season? Next, next, next verse. Next verse. And Daniel went into the king and asked for what? So are you seeing his process? The first thing was what? Wisdom and what? And tact. How do we do under pressure, guys? How do we do? Have we improved? Do we crack under pressure? Be honest. Do you, small thing happens, your life just crumbles, you just talk anyhow. You know some people, they're just holding the windows, boom, finish, it's over. Yes, now. Some of us are holding on to God's word, God's word, and something happens. God is what I say, it's okay. Tommy, come for a bit. Tommy is a strong man. Next, next verse. And what? He returned to what? And explained to his friends. He just returned home and explained to Shadow, Daniel, and Tommy. What did he say? He said, next verse. He urged them to plead for mercy from God. So that he and his friends might not be what? I'm going to tell with this verse. So the first thing I said again is humility. The second thing I said was what? Prior to entry. Let me write these things down. The third thing I said what? Master of what? In this season, the fourth thing is God's mercy. It's God's mercy. Can I have 
people's opinion about God's mercy. Who wants to try? What is God's mercy? Because most people think it's weak. It's a weak thing. You want to try? What's God's mercy? God's mercy is um, what you ask for when you do not know what to do. Fine. What you what you ask for when you don't know what to do. Any any other bodies, any other persons. God's mercy. It's undeserved. Yeah, I think. Yeah. Goal is of of mercy outside. Yeah. So I agree with everyone, and I will just add. Most of us think that God's mercy is only needed when it comes to your crime, but God's mercy is needed when it comes to the body. Somebody can enter trouble, and you go down. Oh, you don't know that. Am I correct? Like what's happening right now. With all due respect, I, I believe in being tight. And it's it's my conviction. It's my work of faith. It's I don't I don't care. I believe it. And I've seen people who have paid tight and have done so much for the kingdom of God. And then, I, and then there's a generation who will not pay tight because someone said it's bad to pay tight and they will never understand that there's an amazing grace in paying what? Tight. Yes, yeah, amazing. It's amazing. It's an amazing grace in paying tight. It's an amazing grace in paying tight. And because of somebody's bad teaching, they are on the left side of grace. Do you get the point? There's in your streets, somebody didn't pay for didn't I repay for Nepal bill. Nepal comes to cut light. It affects the whole world. The whole house. Don't ever think that because you are in good stand with God, you may not ask for mercy. Because of what? Of the body. It happened here. Are we together? He said what? He urged them to plead for God's words. Mercy. So so this we're gonna pray for the for mercy for God's for the body of Christ today. For many reasons. Which includes you. Do you get the point? Most of us think that we are excluded from the body. We're not all. Or not? Next verse. And during the what? The mission was revealed to Daniel, and he what? And he what? And he praised God what? Of heaven. Can we all can we all be honest? Can we all be honest and and and, and just in in two minutes, just just give God glory for everything He's done for you again. Honestly speaking, uh, social media can, can really, like life can be so, do you know some I forget that God, God blesses me, I feel it's my hard work. I won't lie to you, it happens to me regularly. I get confused. So just thank him. Just bless him. Just bless him. Thank him. 